Welcome to Vineyard Wind. This is the first utility scale offshore wind farm in the country. It's being built here off the coast of Massachusetts. What you're looking at there is the substation. Electricity generated by 62 wind turbines will be fed into that substation and then cabled back to shore. The company behind the $4 billion project, Avangrid, arranged a tour today of the construction site for Vineyard Wind 1, which is 15 miles south of Martha's Vineyard. All of the cables are buried under the uh, seabed, and compared to fossil generation or other methods uh, to generate power, this is one of the most environmentally conscious. The small yellow structure that you see sticking out of the ocean is essentially the foundation that the wind turbine towers will be built upon. Next week, the turbines are uh, being installed. The 850 foot tall turbines will be one nautical mile apart from each other. Vineyard Wind 1 will produce 800 megawatts of electricity. That's the equivalent of taking 325,000 vehicles off Massachusetts roads. State Rep Jeffrey Roy co-chairs the Joint Committee that oversees energy. He says one of the many benefits of this massive, clean, renewable energy investment is reduced dependence on energy from other states or other countries. We haven't had energy independence in over 100 years. It was whale oil and New Bedford that uh, lit the land 100 years ago. We're going to be uh, back to energy independence, which means stability and pricing. And those price hikes that we see that are seasonal are going to go away. The wind turbines will be constructed very shortly, and they will begin operation before the end of this year. Reporting from Vineyard Wind, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB, News Center 5.